Today, more than 30 students from West Central made a little history at Elmwood Golf Course by being a part of the first ever first green field trip in South Dakota. This event was put together by the Golf Course Superintendents Association of America with local help from the Southeast Tech Turf Management Program, West Central, First Tee of South Dakota, and the staff at Elmwood. Steve Randall is the Director of Chapter Outreach for the GCSAA, and he couldn't be happier to finally stick a flag in the Rushmore State. This is the first field trip in South Dakota. Uh, first Green is a GCSAA program, and it is our goal to ultimately have a program in all 50 states. Uh, currently, we are working to achieve that and have South Dakota be a part of it. It's very exciting. It was great golf in this area. Uh, folks enjoy and appreciate the game, and we're happy that First Green and South Dakota has hosted a field trip. Students broke into small groups to learn about the importance of course management, how to work on their short game, and a lot more as Elmwood Head Superintendent Todd Zorink explains. Yeah, so they're seeing a little bit of, of everything. So we've got one station where they're actually learning about the game of golf. Uh, we've got another station where they're learning about uh, the different soils and soil properties. Uh, we've got another station where they're learning about a lot of the cool tools that we use, whether it's mowers, uh, moisture meters, um, just everything that we use on a daily basis uh, to, to kind of make management decisions. Um, there's also another station where they're learning uh, all about water and irrigation from conservation to things that go into uh, our decisions on, on how we water daily. And then uh, there's also a, a pollinator uh, station where they're learning about uh, uh, different tree species, uh, different flowers, and just some of the different habitat that's uh, located on the golf course. Kids like Beckett enjoyed getting their hands on the specialized equipment that the pros use to keep our tee boxes tight, fairways fast, and greens in great shape all season long. They also learn the importance of what's under the grass as well. So we've learning how to keep the go golf course uh, kind of good and about trees so far basically. The golf industry is in the midst of the largest growth of the game since the Tiger Woods boom in the late 90s. With that growth comes the need for more kids like Beckett to take part in these experiences so that one day they too may want to become greenskeepers themselves. Yeah, it's. Uh, I, I think it just shows. Uh, you know, we're we're trying to be a leader. We're uh, we're wanting to educate, get people interested about golf, get young kids interested about golf, and uh, not just the sport of golf, but uh, you know, as possible uh, possible career options. I think it's great for students to uh, bring the experience back to their parents and to other students, so they can see, hey, we were on the golf course today. It's a great opportunity and a great experience to put golf in a positive light showcase golf again as an important asset and aspect of every community. 